friends, I am Rip. On this episode, make sure you guys help me share the video on social media so Kevin Kenson sees this. Today, I want to talk about a channel that I believe is one of the best presented channels visually on the internet in the world of gaming on this episode of ReviewTube. Let's take a look at Kevin Kenson. Kevin Kenson was born in March of 1988 and uploaded his first video onto his channel on May 16th, 2014 titled Super Giant Games Transistor Review, a worthy successor to Bastion. When on YouTube, it's hard to think of channels that upload tons of videos but also keep a consistency of really good quality and on this channel, I like to pride myself with being able to do that but upon watching a channel like Kevin Kenson, my pride drops just a little bit. It just looks so nice. We wouldn't be complete without having Cappy on top of our TV. And then of course, none of this would actually make any sense at all if we didn't have a Switch setup going on right here. Now, I love that we're actually set up having the Switch dock sitting on this end of the pipe. You see, this man drops videos a few times a week and these videos are simply quality. They are beautiful. All of the shots in his videos are gorgeous. His cinematography in each and every video keeps my eyes bright and waiting to watch more and more. If you know anything about visuals or cinematography, this will be very apparent to you when watching Kevin Kenson. You will see that he understands depth, lighting, b-roll, focus, audio, design, and so much more. And on top of all of this, Kevin is a video gamer. He loves to dive deep into talks about video games, takes a look at different aesthetics of controllers, and he also does tons of DIY mods. It is very fun and unique to watch his channel. This is also accompanied by a dude who can speak to you about detailed things within video games, but done in a way that you can understand as an everyday gamer or relate to as a more experienced video game connoisseur. Well, you know, I like the theme of the old school SNES. I like the gray they used. I like the purple trim, especially in the inside. The one place where we really think something a little extra could have happened though is on the front lid. Right now his channel is sitting around 270,000 subscribers and I know many people might be thinking then why talk about him? Another Enough people know about him, but I think that he deserves much more than that. And with that said, even if my small little channel can help out in any way, I am more than happy to talk about this channel. Lastly, I just need to say that his thumbnails are top tier and look like they belong in a video game art book. None of them seem out of place or like they don't belong with the others. He remains inventive with his look and appeal, yet while maintaining consistency throughout the channel. Now I know this may sound like a bit of a gush fest, but there is not that many channels that I can admire the whole creative process from start to finish of video games and video game delivery and putting video game content on the internet, but Kevin Kenson is definitely one of them and you need to check him out. Alright guys, that's it. Thank you for watching. Make sure and like the video and also to subscribe. We are here five days a week. If you want to share this anywhere out there and tag Kevin Kenson, I would recommend doing so. Alright you guys, thank you so much for watching and have a great day and I'll see you guys next time. Superhero Game Squad.